Quick disclaimer before the video officially starts, I do not have a beta version of the FNAF VR game. I'm not a beta tester of the game. I don't even I don't have the game in my possession. I haven't talked to Scott at all, though though that would be cool. All these things would be cool. It's not true. I know that last time when I did a Ultimate Custom Night beta testing video, it seemed a bit clickbait and now looking back it it, it kind of was. I didn't mean to make it that way. People that know me for a long time know I that's not my intentions. It just came across that way because I poorly titled it, poor, poor thumbnail, and all like poor advertising, advertising and marketing and all that stuff. So disclaimer: I don't own the game. I don't have the game. I haven't talked to Scott. I just have some news about what Scott has said about the game. So yeah. If you've clicked on this video thinking that you are going to watch some clips about the VR game that's coming or you're going to see me play it, you can just click off right now because that's not going to happen. But if you are here for news about the upcoming game, then continue watching. But first, let's roll the intro. Hello people of the internet, my name is Johnny and welcome back to another FNAF news update video, whatever you want to call it. Today we have some news about the VR game. A few days ago we got news about the, uh, what, what, what is it called again? FNAF Into Madness. About a week or two ago we got news about the ports and today we have news, or I guess yesterday, I don't know, March 3rd of 2019 we have news about the VR game Five Nights at Freddy's Help Wanted, I believe it's called. It should be, yeah, yeah, Help Wanted. So, in Darko's video celebrating the four-year anniversary of Five Nights at Freddy's, Scott popped in to say a few words, and here's what he said. Oh, Scott, I received the beta version of the VR game last night. I'll be testing it today. You guys are going to love it. I'm very happy with it so far. Hey! I'm so excited for it too, man! So that's what he said. In the live stream, he said that he received the demo or the beta, I honestly can't remember. I recorded this clip when it first came out about five or so hours ago. But yeah, he said that he got a demo or beta of Five Nights at Freddy's Help Wanted the VR game. He said that he's happy with how it is and he's excited for us to see it. And that's all he said. That's all he said. But, now you may be thinking that's not much to go off of, but if we compare it to previous times when he has been testing and playing to make sure everything is stable, previous games, like Ultimate Custom Night, him and his sons, Brian I think, and some other boy, I'm sorry I forget your guys' names, but yeah, after they were done testing, or while they were testing, the game, Ultimate Custom Night, came out like a month or two at later, so we should be expecting the VR game to come out in the next few months based on previous events. But then again, it, the VR game isn't being made by Scott, so they may or may not have, and we don't know how many things they have to fix or change, so depending on what they have to do to the game, how long we have to wait can vary drastically and it's really just guessing because like we said he hasn't said anything about the release date he just said that he's happy for us to see it and that he's happy where it is right now and that's it i don't have a game i'm not going to show you the game that's it just some news all right you guys happy you should be because <laughs> that's all you're gonna get <laughs> but you guys did get something pretty interesting before this video if, uh, if you haven't seen it, I won't spoil it, but Scott did confirm one of the most important theories in the FNAF history. Four years ago today, actually, yeah, because it started with FNAF 3. It started in FNAF 3. So make sure you check out the video I uploaded before this one about Scott confirming one of the most serious and important theories in FNAF history. But anyways, guys, that's it for this update video. Thank you everyone so much for watching, and I will see you all on the flip side. Goodbye.